So uh, here we are after the downloaded has been finished. So here we have a, a zip file here. So we have to extract is first. And then go to the folder again and uh, go to this folder panel and uh, I'm open this image data and you can see here we have a uh, 10 meter 20 meter and uh, 60 meter so I'm going to use the 10 meter data and uh, here you can see the bands of Sentinel 2 a MSI you can see the band number 2 band 2 is blue band 3 is green uh, band 4 is red and band number 8 is NIR and we have these bands in Sentinel 2 image okay so uh, in our, in our uh, software RTS we are going to uh, create a map by combining these uh, bands here band, uh, band number 8 red band blue band green band and uh, the NIR go okay so here we are in our map and uh, go to your art toolbox then uh, go to data management tools and uh, find raster and raster processing and uh, double click here composite bands then click here to add our files uh, i'm going to add the band number two three four and eight uh, two is the uh, blue band uh, three green red and near infrared and click add and i'm going to select the output raster okay i have created a folder uh, in here called composite bands and i'm going to rename my file as sentinel 2 0 to 1 and click uh, to 1 0 2 Okay, sorry, you have to specify the extension again. Uh, click here, Sentinel. Sentinel 2, 202102. We have to specify the extension. I am going to uh, specify my uh, extension at dot .tif and click save. And click OK to run the tool. Okay, so after uh, this is uh, this, this image we uh, got after the composite, uh, we combined them together, and you can see the red is now is uh, showing the corresponding to band number one, and which is um, blue band. So you can change band number here. Band number three is red band, and uh, band number one is blue band. Okay, so uh, you can see this is the uh, natural or true color image we can say and uh, if you can go to the properties then you can see the in the general bar here and uh, the source you can see the cell size is uh, 10 into 10 or the resolution is uh, 10 meter resolution and you can also see many uh, like uh, data here or uh, scaling uh, the xy coordinating system here Okay, so this is it. Uh, that's how we can combine uh, uh, Sentinel-2 images bands uh, in ArcMap and uh, use it uh, to your projects or any kinds of uh, work you can uh, do with it. So thank you for watching this video and uh, if you like this video, please uh, subscribe to our channel and uh, give this video a like. Thank you.